Neos Therapeutics cheering an FDA approval of its ADHD drug. What makes the approved drug different from other treatments on the market? High Jane shares of Neos Therapeutics are rallying 30%. The FDA approved the company's treatment for ADHD. Adzenis XRODT is a long-acting drug approved for patients six years and older. Now, the treatment is an extended-release orally disintegrating tablet and the only one available for the treatment of ADHD. It relies on the company's proprietary extended-release technology. Now, according to the National Institute of Mental Health, ADHD is one of the most common childhood disorders and can continue through adolescence and into adulthood. The average age of onset is seven years old. In the U.S., ADHD affects about 4% of adults age 18 years and older in a given year. It affects 9% of children age 13 to 18 years, and boys are four times at risk compared to girls. Now, ADHD symptoms include hyperactivity, poor concentration, and learning difficulties. The innovation for treating ADHD is good news for patients. On the heels of its milestone, when will Neos Therapeutics ADHD drug be launching? Neos Therapeutics plans to educate healthcare providers immediately. The company expects to launch and ship product in the second quarter of this year. The extended release drug will be available in six dosage strengths. Because the tablet is an orally disintegrating one and requires only one tablet per day, it may be easier to take for children who dislike swallowing pills. It is bioequivalent to FDA-approved Adderall XR, which is an extended-release mixed amphetamine salt capsule. And what is the outlook for the Texas-based pharma company? Neos Therapeutics says it plans to develop other treatment options with its technology platforms. It is investigating its proprietary extended-release drug delivery technology in ODT and extra liquid suspension formulations of amphetamine as well as methyl bendiate. It does hope to deliver a portfolio of drugs in various uh, dosage forms. Now, Neos has a marketed product called Tucionex. It is used to treat cough and lung symptoms caused by the common cold or allergies. It does contain an antihistamine and hydrocodone. Codone. The FDA's latest approval is a milestone for Neos Therapeutics. Back in 2013, the FDA rejected the drug, but the company resubmitted its NDA last summer with new data from a study. Now that the treatment has been approved, RBC Capital sees an adjusted per share value of $22. In midday trade on Thursday, Neos is eyeing 13 bucks a share.